Assalamualaikum. Welcome to Nasir Soft. In this tutorial series, we will work on Rapid Miner. The Rapid Miner is a data science software platform that provides an integrated environment for data preparation, machine learning, deep learning, text mining, and predictive analysis. First, we will download and install the Rapid Miner. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install the Rapid Miner software and how you can prepare the software for your use. So the first step is go to your browser and here write Rapid Miner. Okay. Download for PC and go to the Rapid Miner official site that is rapidminer.com okay and inside this one inside the rapid miner studio click on the download button so i am using the uh, windows 64 version so therefore in my scenario i click on that one if you are using the windows 32 bit or mac or something like other operating system then go to your relevant section so here i will press the uh, windows 64 after some second you will see that the downloading is start okay so let let it complete thing is now completed so let's install it click on this downloaded exe file after pressing yes then click on the next i agree by default the destination folder is this one okay if you want to change then click on the browse button for further change and there is the space space required that is 372 mb okay so i press on install button after some time the installation will complete Installation is completed. So click on finish and launch the Rapid Miner Studio. Allow access. And now the Rapid Miner is loading series of extension okay time series for example it different initialization the operator and now it preparing the setup for you now it shows me that this dialog and uh, that is the end user license agreement so click on i have read and understand the terms of end user license agreement and click on the accept button So you see that now it launched the rapid miner but the login to your rapid miner account is mandatory to use okay so so don't worry if you have not uh, uh, the uh, user of rapid miner then just create on the uh, new rapid miner account and it, it is for free okay so after uh, you build your account okay so you need to log in to that account for example in my scenario my account is i have already an account in rapid miner so by providing this credential i can log into the rapid miner account so here i write my credential and i press on the login and install and it will take some time for preparing the environment and now all environment are set up so i am ready click on i am ready so this is the rapid miner studio okay so don't worry it looks complex but it is very simple believe me at the left side by default it shows the tutorial okay so by pressing the next next button and reading all these words you can understand well about this uh, rapid miner okay so if you're not uh, familiar with the rapid miner so so don't worry i will teach you about the basic of rapid miner okay for the quick startup 
so at the left side this is the repository okay we can upload uh, or import anything from our local repository or by default inside the samples folder it provides us with a lot of uh, tutorial data for example if i go to the data data folder and here there is a lot of uh, by default uh, to providing some data for uh, for our understanding like the titanic data okay so we can uh, also view this uh, data okay so by just drag and drop here inside the processor okay this is the processor and inside the process sorry this is the process and inside the process it it shows us about all the process okay so as i uh, just drag and drop the titanic data okay what is the titanic inside the titanic data so there is a lot of data that's uh, if i double click on that you will see that there is something passenger data its name sex age and so on okay so it's all about the data it provided by default okay so this is the titanic data and if we work on that data just drag and drop inside the process okay and at the left down there is an operators and inside the operator there are many thing uh, many things uh, i will show you later okay like inside the data access binding cleaning there are many built-in models okay inside now if i talks about this is a design view and when you click on the result view if you have some results okay for example you train your model and when you click on the result and it shows you all the outputs of that model so our first step is after drag and drop the titanic data so for example how can i uh, work on that data okay so this is the input okay and this is the output if i just drag and drop the output to the this the here okay for the output and if i click on the start button you will see that it's by default there is no operation i just show the output of that file that is titanic file and it shows me all the data inside the titanic file okay if i close this one and i go to the design okay so here you will find that there is no error in the data and this ex uh, is successfully executed so now delete this data for just pressing the delete button by clicking on that uh, process okay so i drag and drop the new process uh, new data inside the process that is titanic training okay it provides me by default some data for practice okay so this is the data that is tri uh, titanic training data okay and inside the operator operators i want to apply the decision tree that is a built-in algorithm to that training data so that is the beauty of rapid miner how easily you can uh, just drag and drop you can work with the data science uh, algorithms okay so here write for example decision tree you can search here okay inside the search this is the inside the trees this is the decision tree so drag and drop this decision tree operators to the process so i want to apply decision tree okay in this titanic training data so therefore i connect the titanic data output to the as an input of the decision tree so just drag and drop to this one okay so now the titanic data output is connected as an input and decision tree it means that we are providing the decision tree we are applying the decision tree to the titanic data and after applying the decision tree algorithm to that data give me the output this is the output module okay so inside this one that is mod just drag and drop this one as an output here okay if you see that we apply the titanic data a decision tree algorithm on that data and give us the output if i press on the this one button this is the start button okay well, you'll see that after some second it will show us the output as a decision tree okay if you click on the minimizing then a complete decision tree will showing to you okay so this is the beauty of rapid miner as you see that the built-in decision tree algorithm we apply with an easy steps to some data if i go to the again design so this is the basic of rapid miner so now i again delete to 
something more big about the rapid miner okay so just select all these and press on delete button all these are deleted okay so now i am showing you something more interesting about the rapid miner for example this is the titanic data okay so how can i filter it for example inside the sex there are male and female so i only want to uh, to know about the data that are female okay so how can i filter this one? so by the filter there is also an operator inside the rapid miner okay so first step is inside the process drag and dot that data in which we want to apply a filter okay and now inside the operators you can write something filter okay filter example so this is the filter example okay so drag and drop this filter example and inside this filter just click on that filter and inside the right side that is a parameters and inside the parameter click on add filters so i want to add only that record where the sex is female so how can i add this one click on add filters and inside this one the column the column will be like sex that is not in is equal so there is a correct match okay so by default it not showing me the column this is why because inside that filter we not apply which data to want to uh, which we want to add filters okay so just uh, drag and drop this output as an input of that filter and now click on add filters and here you will see that it pop up all the uh, columns okay so uh, we add i want to add where sex is only equal to that is female okay here you can write on by just pressing about this magic that is female okay so okay click on okay so after showing me the output and if i press on the start button then it's showing me all these data with that filter that sex should be equal to female okay if i play this one you will see that all female data is showing to me so that is the easiness and importance of rapid miner then how easily we can handle with the filters with the operators by providing these parameters as well so in this tutorial one last thing i will show you that is how we can add or sort the element so after applying the filters that gives me all the female data so i want to sort it by some uh, something for example if i click double click on the titanic value okay and here i can sort with the number of uh, things okay so the first step is delete this output so now i don't want to uh, output as the uh, just filter data so here inside the operators here i write the sort there is also a sort operator here okay so this is the sort so this is a sort operator uh, for, uh, by using this sort operator we can arrange the our output as an ascending or descending order okay so this will take the filter as an input filter output as an input and when i click on the sort here inside the parameter there is two things uh, which attributes you want to uh, sort on the base of which attribute for example if i click in here so here i will uh, mention that here there is a various number of uh, uh, columns we can sort by ascending or descending order on base of this uh, these columns okay so for example i will sort by the name where name is in descending order okay to so sort the data with respect to the name in descending order and show me this output so first we apply the input with the, with the filters that only showing me the female data with the sort and sort the data with respect to the name of the passenger in decreasing order if i click on the start button you will see that the decreasing name all females 
are showing me in that order. So this is the basic of rapid miner. So hope you will understand about the basic of rapid miner. So that's all for this video. In the next video, we will start from here. And in next video, I will show you how you can import your own data that is inside your local computer, some CSV file or some data, how you import this one in rapid miner and work with uh, how you can work with that. Okay. So if you have any questions uh, regarding to this topic, uh, you can email me. Email is mentioned in video description or you can comment inside the video comment section. Don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos. See you in next video. Have a nice day.